Good afternoon, everyone. Rob Lukey with our capital group in Shop Prop Realty. I'm going to take a couple seconds to go over a couple of uh, interesting charts that I've shown in the past. Over uh, the past performance that we've been achieving so far this year, and then maybe dip into our software on the R Capital Group site. On the Seattle, on the Shop Prop Realty, remember uh, Shop Prop, obviously, we share our commission with our customers. If you're a buyer buying a uh, property, remember, you can receive some of the commission. I know that from a standpoint of realtors, uh, organization has, has us to believe that the seller pays the commission. That may be the case, but remember, that commission is the price of the property. You can, you, as a buyer, you can receive some of that commission. As a matter of fact, on our home page, you can take a look and see what the U.S. Department of Justice is saying about commission rebates to buyers and sellers. And they go on to it and they say that they're fighting uh, the, those organizations right now because rebates are so uh, important for buyers and sellers lowering the price of their properties uh, in the position that people that are receive rebates are in a much better position than those people that don't. Uh, so anyhow, going back to a couple of charts that I wanted to go over, one of them is the rent versus buy chart. This was something that I mentioned uh, earlier uh, last year uh, when we were looking at, uh, when we said, hey, to buy right now is cheaper than renting. There's a couple things that are occurring right now. You're first of all seeing that renting is becoming uh, better than buying. Uh, in this situation, we were able to buy properties for that and it was less expensive to buy a property than to rent a property you're seeing that that change it's still within the realm of that we don't necessarily have to worry about it too much but it's something to keep an eye on and it might actually get a little bit more aggressive because you've had a lot of hedge funds come into this market buy properties the rental market has got it has actually gotten bigger uh, and so we just want to keep an eye on that particular on this particular chart we also, uh, one other chart I wanted to go over was obviously the case Schiller. We talked about, again, this V bottom uh, environment is uh, recovery. Again, we're still within the terms of, in the terms of uh, reasonableness as far as the home prices increases. But I would expect to start to see some type of choppiness as we uh, uh, at this level now. That doesn't mean that I don't think that we're going to continue to see this move, but when we spoke about this V bottom recovery, we've had that, and now some choppy uh, movement up is probably to be expected. Going to our capital group, again, remember, you can always go to our past performance. You can, uh, uh, in our past performance, you can see the properties that we're in, and you can also see the returns, some of the returns that we've recently received. Uh, here's a property on Olive Way. We bought it on 7.5, a little bit over a month, and a 7.12% return. I mean, good, and you, you want to annualize that. A month and a half for 7.12% is obviously a great annual return. Three now, here's uh, Orcus. We bought this on 5.24, sold it on 8.13, so under three months, 13.4%. We're pending on this property, pending on this property, almost done with rehab on Mount Lake Terrace in Des Moines that we'll be listing here shortly. And then we just took possession uh, of these properties and we're going to be starting rehab on that. If you have an account with us, again, that's if you don't have an account with us, you can always watch that. If you have an account with us, you can always go to our capital group and you can go to uh, your account and you'll receive an account similar to like this that will show you your estimated value, properties you're in. You can go to your current holdings and you can see what properties you're in, uh, with the percentage you own. As you can see, I, I, I own the we own the majority of the each of these properties, but somebody also owns a portion of Shoreline. So when they log on, that client will see that. They can then go ahead and view what is going on with that property via the notes, pictures, and so forth. So it's something again, if you take a look at uh, let's take a look at Fullerton and you owned a piece of that, you could go look at it and kind of see what the rehab, how the rehab is going and so forth if you click on the uh, data and the pictures in our capital group. So you'll be able to see, oh, that's, so they've done some rehab there in, in Fullerton. So again, something to take a look at. Uh, if that, that's something that interests you, you can always give us a call. You also can obviously search on available properties. And remember, you can sign up 
for a uh, user as a trial user without signing any documentation and you can go ahead and get access to it you'll be looking at old data but it might be interesting to you to see and go ahead and say okay well what happened at last week's auction in uh, California for example uh, I mean excuse me in Washington and we can go ahead and put in that date we can go ahead and then look at the hot properties that were in our capital group those are properties that we consider to be hot properties you can go ahead and search uh, for those properties and you can see what happened with them this property uh, obviously was postponed it wasn't sold here was a property purchase price was 235,000 uh, this was a property that was in Kirkland we were actually bidding on this property here's another property purchase price was 263,000 so obviously we the opening bid on this was 293,000 but you can go back and you can look at them and say what if I wanted to buy any of those properties potentially for myself to go ahead and uh, enter into the uh, property uh, I mean excuse me to go ahead and be able to buy the property as an end user or a uh, rehab or whatever this was actually the profit the property that we picked up yesterday I mean excuse me Friday at auction this was one of our properties but again look through it you can get an idea of properties that uh, may or may not be of interest to you this was a nice property in uh, Soquami, and you can click on hot properties. It only takes you a little while to go ahead and do that. And that's with the trial user without signing any documents. And remember, it's very simple to get involved with the real estate market, with us at least, is all you have to do is oh, we open an account with you, for you. We have You have your money sitting in Wargo, and when you're ready to make a purchase, you can say just simply invest $400,000 and you can either say at OCG's discretion or you could choose you know at three uh, the next three properties that OCG's buys and you can pick either the cities or the at OCG discretion or you can pick the actual uh, counties that you'd like to be in you agree to the terms of your conditions and you place your order so anyhow I hope everybody has a good day if you have any questions either on our capital group or shop property and how you can benefit from using uh, shop prop uh, versus a full commission realtor uh, then feel free to give us a call uh, or visit our website www.shopprop.com or our, cap our capitalgroup.com thank you